E X T L U S I V E. Big Ed Brown won his time on the 90 Day Fiancé franchise and future appearances. Ed Brown is one of the most famous cast members from the 90 Day Fiancé franchise. His journey began on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 days when he met Rose Vega. Ed and Rose had met online and after four months he decided to go meet her in the Philippines. Unfortunately, it didn't take long for their relationship to sour, which left Ed heartbroken. After coming home, however, Ed began a new relationship with Liz Woods on 90 Day, The Single Life. For five seasons, viewers watched the tumultuous dynamic between Ed and Liz unfold. The former couple went on to appear on two seasons of 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, as well as the debut season of 90 Day, The Last Resort. Ultimately, Ed decided that he and Liz weren't a good fit, which led him to call off their wedding during Happily Ever After, Season 8. Reality T had the chance to catch up with Ed and find out how he's doing post-breakup. Ed had a lot to say about his time on the show, as well as several big things he has in store for the future. Ed has been on our screens for several years now. He is no longer the man he was when viewers first met him. When asked if he ever thought he would become so famous, Ed answered, I had no idea. He had never even heard of the show, which is ironic given that he has become one of its most popular stars. Despite producers telling him he would be known worldwide, Ed never believed such a thing could be possible. Altogether, Ed was featured on six seasons of 90 Day Fiancé spin-offs, which is more than the average cast members. We asked Ed to pick a favorite season of his, starting from his debut on Before the 90 Days up until his recent season of Happily Ever After. Ed replied that his favorite season was Before the 90 Day Season 4, because I didn't know what I was doing. Furthermore, Ed emphasized that the world really got to capture who I was. On the other hand, Ed's most recent season featured an interesting twist, Happily Ever After. Season 8 had all the couples live together during the tell-all, which made for some interesting twists. When asked how he felt about the new format, Ed responded, The thing that felt most interesting was that we would go to the studio and tear each other up. Then you go back to the house and everyone would be drinking and having a good time. While the new tell-all format was certainly untraditional, it did make for a lot of fun. After season eight, viewers may be curious to know if Ed ever has plans to film again. Ed admitted, you know, I'm not really sure. He explained that he's focusing on his career at the moment, but added TLC's welcome to come along for the ride. After a few back-to-back -back seasons of filming, Ed is firmly focused on the future. Following his split from Liz, we asked Ed what his current relationship status is today. Ed recently posted with a new mystery woman on Instagram, leading fans to speculate that he may be seeing her. Ed replied, She's somebody that's a very good friend of mine. She's somebody that likes to remain private. However, he added that he thinks it's gonna lead to something special. Apart from his love life, Ed has more plans for the near future, with one right around the corner. On Friday, September 13th and Saturday, September 14th, Ed will be participating in a special partnership with Capriati Sandwich Shop in Plantation, Florida. Ed's appearance will be raising money for a foundation called Remembering Nicholas, which is near and dear to his heart. The event will feature a Big Ed sub, which features turkey, cranberry, stuffing, and mayo. The sandwich is also a 24 karat gold flake version of another sandwich on the menu. Ed will be behind the counter making sandwiches himself, which will be a great opportunity for fans to meet and interact with him. Furthermore, Ed emphasized, we're also going to be doing a lot of fun games and I'll be signing headshots and giving out stickers. Ed's partnership with Capriati's is certainly an opportunity you don't want to miss.